In the previous video, you saw how to interface the HMI with a micro PLC to detect the value of an analog input. To read the status of a digital input, the procedure is very similar, with some small differences. Let's find out how. Compared to a register, the status of a digital input is an on-off variable, which can, therefore, have only two values, 0 or 1. Use the Modbus manual of the LRD series micro PLC to consult the corresponding register, mapped to the address 611 hexadecimal, which is 1553 in decimal. It is one word long and contains the states of all the digital inputs integrated in the micro PLC from I1 to IC. This means that you can read them all at once, without having to configure them individually. Then create the tag. In the Tags window, click on the plus button to create a new tag. For example, name it Inputs. Then click on the Address field to configure the properties of the tag. In the Memory Type field, select Holding Registers, and in the Offset field, enter the address of the tag in decimal. In our example, 1553, add it to the value 400,000, convention used by the Modbus protocol for registers, then 401,553. In the Data Type field, set the data type, in this case, unsigned short, which is one word long. Lastly. Press OK to confirm. Now the tag has been created and can be used within the project. Reading this tag, the micro PLC will respond with a value that, interpreted in binary, will contain the status of all the digital inputs of the micro PLC. As you can see from the Modbus table, bit 0 will be the status of input I1, bit 1 will be the status of input I2, and so on. Let's now see how to associate a specific input to an indicator within a page of the HMI. Enter the configuration window of the page and from the widget gallery, select an indicator of type light. On the right of the screen, from the properties window of the indicator, click on the plus button in the value field. The window with the project tags opens. Select the inputs tag. To select a specific bit of this tag, for example, a specific input, in this case, click on the bit byte indexing item. Enable the bit index item and enter the bit value of the input's register you want to read. For example, if you want to read input I3, write bit index equals 2. Lastly, write the project in the HMI and check its operation. As you can see, by modifying the status of input I3 on the PLC, the color of the indicator on the HMI page changes.